Good evening. And uh, Chairman Leonard was certainly joking. He knows that I will be brief and be seated. I am indeed honored to have been invited back for this awesome celebration uh, this evening. As you heard Principal Creighton say, this has been a labor of love. And so I'm grateful to have the opportunity to see the fruits uh, of the labor. I must say that it feels a little odd not to be starting my comments with the following. On behalf of the Chatham County Board of Education, uh, you know, those things that superintendents normally say. But as the former superintendent, I can tell you that as I go across this state, I am even more convinced that Chatham County Schools is a district to watch, and I am indeed proud uh, of that. I want to just take a few minutes to talk about uh, this work that you see culminated here before you tonight. Many, many, many years uh, went into the building of this school, and several people who've already been mentioned and some who will uh, be mentioned later can relate to uh, some of the things that I'm going to say. Uh, we faced NIMBYs. Anybody know what a NIMBY is? Not in my backyard. So when we started looking for land to build the new high school, everybody wanted the new high school, but nobody wanted it in their backyard. So I'm so excited that we were able to overcome that. Once we overcame that, then we had to deal with rock uh, and had to deal with uh, clearing the land and a number of other things along the way. So it's not as easy as one would think, but I am just so proud of uh, the work that has happened. And it has been a result of collaboration between the Board of Education and the Board of Commissioners. Uh, I, I can't tell you how exciting it is to be able to stand before you and say that we have had three three county managers during my tenure as superintendent, and all three were fully committed to ensuring that the Board of Education and the Board of Commissioners work collaboratively. So I'd be remiss if I did not acknowledge Charlie Horn, Renee Pascal, and Dan LaMontagne. As I conclude, I want to leave you with four things. First, quality learning environments are essential. Number two, leadership matters. And I'm not just talking about principal leadership, assistant principal leadership, or central services leadership. The leadership of the Board of Education, the leadership of the Board of Commissioners absolutely matters. And I want to encourage them to continue modeling the relationship that every other school district in this state and beyond should emulate. It's okay to disagree, and they do at times, but I've never found them to be disagreeable, and that's certainly worthy of acknowledgement. And last but not least, as a citizen, a resident of Chatham County, I'm looking forward to more construction and more improvements across this district. Thank you so much. Uh, for all that you do day in and day out to support our students, because at the end of the day, that's what it's all about. Congratulations to Seaford.